So in this episode, we're going to be talking about a two-column title crawl. What is a two-column title crawl, you ask? Well, let me show you. It's where you have the name of the character or role or whatever somebody did in a film on one side and the name of the individual on the other side. As you notice, the roles are all right justified, or correction, the roles are all, no, they are right justified, and the names are all left justified. So let's show you how that's done. What we're going to do, we're going to come over here and we are going to delete our clip. Now we're going to come over here and we're going to go to our A icon, go to Boris, title crawl. We're going to drag down our title crawl into our doc. We're going to double click it, go to controls, and we're going to set our animation style to crawl and double click on title crawl. Now what we're going to do is I'm just going to enter in some dummy text here and we're going to come down here to our page wrap or text wrap and we're going to set up a wrap. So we're going to go text wrap, wrap, and we're going to set this for 640. And if you're, depending on what size you're working, is going to determine uh, the text wrap. We're working in high def 1080, so our text wrap is going to be 640. If you're working in something a little bit smaller, your text wrap will obviously be smaller. Now, we're also going to set our margins to zero. This is just a personal thing I like to do. It, you know, if you want margins, great. And we're going to come over here to our text. Now what we're going to do is we need to go ahead and set up some margins. So the first thing we're going to do, or not some margins, but some tabs. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and center justify everything. And we're going to come up here to this ruler looking thing and we're going to set a center justify. All we're going to do is we're going to click on our mouse. We're going to get this little line and now we're going to put the center justify as center as we can get it. Now what we're going to do is we're going to click the left justify and we're going to drag the left justify to the right of the center justify marker and we're going to drag it on the ruler and we're going to do the same thing for our right justify we're going to come over here and we want our left justify and right justifies the same width from the center now what we're going to do is we're going to hit tab and we notice that our text is now justified on the right. We're going to hit tab again, that puts us on the center, we're going to tab again, and now we can go ahead and type whatever we want. If we hit return, and we start typing, everything is centered to the right, but if we hit tab, let's go back, we'll go to the beginning actually, we'll hit tab, and now it centers it to the, or it justifies it to the right. If we click the end of the text, hit tab, it now goes in the center justify, Hit tab one more time, and now we can justify it to the left, but to the right of the center. We'll hit return one more time, and we'll go ahead and show you this one more time. So we hit return, hit tab. Now we have it on the, we have it right justified, but to the left of the center. We'll hit tab again. Now we're centered. We're not going to type anything. Hit tab one more time, and we will go ahead and write, uh, write again. And what we can do is if we want these a little bit smaller, we can go ahead and bring our tabs in a little bit, bring them in as close as we need to, or if something isn't really set as center as we want, we can go ahead and readjust the center. Oops, dragged in an extra tab there. So what we'll go ahead and do is we'll go ahead and move the center to where we want it, and then now we can go ahead and change our tabs. Now what we're going to do is we're going to hit apply, and as you should see, we will have a two column justify. And if you notice, I messed up. I made a crawl. What we want is we want a roll. There we go. And now we have it as a two column roll. All right. I hope that was uh, beneficial for you. I know it's kind of confusing. If you have any questions, put them down in the comments and we will answer them. Thank you very much.